Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Veronica. I am going to be using this platform to post daily life things. So like vlogs, I'm gonna be posting Get Ready With Me as I'm doing a Get Ready With Me today. Um, I'm also going to do my lip filler experience. Sorry, I got one syringe of lip filler about like a month or so ago, going back for more, I think it's in like two weeks. So I'm going to videotape that and I will post that once I get that video done. I'm doing a get ready with me today. I'm gonna go and blow dry my hair and then I will be back. Okay, sorry if the lighting changed. Um, I did my hair off camera, so I'm going to be putting makeup on, obviously. <laughs> Um, all right, um, for my brows, I use, sorry, it's gonna be backwards, I think, but it's the Anastasia Brow Definer, and I pretty much just use that. I used to use the, okay, this mirror is dirty, sorry. I used to use, like, the dip pomade thing. This mirror is so dirty. I don't know how many more times I can say that. Okay. But it's Halloween today, by the way. I'm sorry if you can hear my fan. But it's kind of warm in here. Um, I'm just going to do like a basic makeup look. Well, I'm going to put lashes on but like nothing like crazy. Sorry, I need to like, but comment below what your makeup routine is. If you guys do anything different or out of order, not out of order, but like different order than how I do it. Cause I know everyone does or applies their makeup on at different steps. Um, not dressing up for Halloween just cause I, haven't ever well I have obviously when I was like younger but I'm not really like into like the whole dress up thing but I think it's cool to see everyone's costumes to be honest but I won't get trick-or-treaters because I live in an apartment complex um so we do not get them I think we could have but like our buildings have locks like you can't just like get into our building, you have to have a key. And there's multiple here, multiple buildings. It's not like just like one big apartment building. I think they're leaving the doors up, like open. Cause they did have the option that if you wanted to like have trick or treaters, you could, sorry. My hair's frizzy, I just did it, but I have work tomorrow. So I'll redo it or fix it in the morning. So my hair's not like, perfect and for whatever reason super warm today like it's really nice out and it's been chilly so I just find that so odd also if my video is like in bits and pieces I'm probably going to like <laughs> if my video is in bits and pieces or different snippets I'm going to be like editing clips and putting them together Do you ever just want to shave your eyebrows off? Or your head? Sorry, my hair is like... See, I straightened it, but like... My hair is naturally curly. It takes me forever to do my makeup. Four minutes into a video and says it takes forever to do your makeup. Me. That didn't make any sense. Oh. Honestly, this is not going to be perfect. Honestly, I kind of like wish I had trick or treaters so I could see their little outfits. <laughs> the little kids are so cute with their outfits. But my parents give out candy. They live in like a neighborhood, so I think people from other neighborhoods come into their neighborhood. 
All right, always remember eyebrows are sisters. They're not twins. I think my boyfriend's gonna come in here and be like, who are you talking to? Are you talking to yourself again, Veronica? Yes, I am I'm talking to myself. Sorry if I'm not looking at the camera or if it looks like I'm looking off somewhere else, it's literally because I am. <laughs> it's literally because I am. Do you ever just always have a stomach ache? Or am I just like broken? Because I was at stomach ache. Oh, you can literally see the fan that's blowing, sorry. I do not have an aesthetically pleasing background. That's okay. We're not here to be aesthetically, is that how you say it? Aesthetically pleasing? I hope you guys can hear me. Honest, honest, honest. Okay. I don't even know how I'm gonna edit this. I've honestly, sorry, my mirror is like, how do people, how are you, how are people YouTubers? Can someone tell me how? How do you do your makeup? Like I get ready with, this color doesn't match my face, I know. But, you know what's best about that is that you wear a top that covers your chest or you put makeup on your chest. People don't even know. People don't even know. They'll never know. What is that audio from TikTok? <laughs> They'll never know. Oh, shoot. I feel like I'm saying it wrong. Oh, I colored my eyebrow and shoot. Oh my God. Someone comment below and tell me what TikTok sound I'm talking about. Please, because I don't remember how it goes. I honestly wonder how loud I'm being right now. I don't think I am. I'm not being loud, but like my iPhone audio picks up really well. I just stopped it to hear because I didn't want to get through an entire get ready with me and then be like, couldn't hear me. Um, but my YouTube channel, it's just going to be like, life uh, i'm definitely gonna do my lip filler experience just have to ask her if she's okay with me filming it she can't if she doesn't want me to then i will just um i'll just like film the before and after type of thing but i'm gonna post it before the two week healing is done i have one syringe in my lips right now uh, if you guys dressed up for halloween let me know what you wear. See, I swear it's the coffee that, sorry, my stomach is literally hurting right now. I think it's the coffee I drink. But like coffee's just too good. Coffee's too good. This is, sorry, this is awkward. Uh, what do you guys, who do you guys watch on YouTube? Let me know. Who are, who are your favorite YouTubers and why? I watch, I feel like I, it's so hard because I honestly watch, I watch a lot of couple channels. Um, and I, I don't, like I know a lot of people watch like the drama channels like I don't follow along with that stuff it's way too complicated for me and like I don't even know how accurate it is I feel like it's just all lies just to entertain people you know again oh, that's okay that's okay I'll tell you why I just did that I forgot to put primer on but that's okay I just did my eyebrows I can put it on after sorry I need to learn to keep my mirror down I would play music then I would get copyrighted. Sorry, it's really bothering me that like my hair is frizzy on one side. I'm gonna put makeup on to then take it off. What did you do today? I um, slept till 10 and I put makeup on to take it off. How about you? That sounds so stupid though because I meant like I'm taking, oh, I just pulled a muscle. Did you just see that? Like, I put makeup on, I mean, like, and I'm pretty much going to take it off almost right after. Maybe. 
I might leave it on for a little bit and then take it off right before bed to get like a use out of it. But I'm not going anywhere, sorry, this is the, oh, I just used Elf Primer again. It's gonna be backwards on the camera because I'm using my iPhone and I'm facing the video feed towards me. So that's why it's gonna be backwards. Can I talk about how I have to work tomorrow? Oh, I put way too much on there. Whatever, this is just to like prime my eyes. Just kidding. My face is gonna get increasingly more red the more foundation I put on my face because my face is like naturally red. I don't know why. Like I just think I was born with like, like I don't have bad skin. Like I don't break out much. Like I, okay, I have freckles on my face. It's not breakouts, but I do break out around like my time of the month. Honestly, sometimes it's fun to put makeup on, but then other times it's like super stressful. It's like, why did I just put on that makeup on? I'm so sorry, I'm looking at myself and not at the camera. From Massachusetts, I live in Massachusetts. I've only ever lived in Massachusetts. I just said it like I moved. Um, it's fall. Let's just state the obvious, Veronica. My name's Veronica. Um, oh, I have a full-time job. Not gonna talk about my job on here because don't wanna talk about it, to be honest. Just kinda keep that part out of it. If you know me personally, you know what I do. I'm gonna put eyeliner on. I'm also putting lashes on. You know, sometimes I get like the right amount of eyeliner and then other times it looks like I took a black sharpie and just like colored my eyelid in I have two brothers I have a mom and a dad I'm waiting for my boyfriend to come through that door I have a mom and dad <laughs> who the hell says that obviously I have parents how else did I get here Oh, obviously I have a mom at least. I gave birth to me. Um, I'm moving in with my parents soon to save money for a house because living in Massachusetts. If you live in Massachusetts, you know what I'm saying. It's expensive, man. So expensive. But Honestly, don't know if I would live anywhere else. Does anyone else use baby wipes to remove their makeup? My friend gave me that idea. But yeah, I live in Massachusetts. Currently living with my boyfriend and his brother. Moving in with my parents in January. To save some money, cause I am broke. I'm kind of broke, kind of, just like a little bit. You know, okay, it doesn't suck to put makeup on as much as it used to because I was working from home and I just never wore makeup during the week, but I'm used to putting it on like every day now at this point, every day, it's 5.30 at night and I'm putting makeup on. You know, you gotta look cute while sleeping, just kidding, I'm not keeping my makeup on all night. I need to put eyelashes on, that's what I'm doing. Ooh, where did they go? <laughs> Hold on, they're not in their box. I'm, a, I'm an idiot. I just had them squished. So I used the Kiss Lash Con, I'm not gonna talk. It's gonna be backwards, I'm sorry. But it looks like that, I got it at Walmart, I think. I think. The thing is, I really like Lily Lashes. I really like Lily Lashes, I just choked. Um, because the band on them, way better. Just so much easier to work with. The bands on like cheap lashes, pain in the butt, that's okay. We love them because they're cheap. And again, probably the entire time I'm gonna be looking at myself. I am so sorry. I'll, I'll improve, hopefully. Pretty much this channel is just gonna be like about me, chilling, guys. <laughs> 
sorry. She's really upsetting me. Yeah, it's just gonna be me. Um, and my loft. Ooh, I'll be able to show you what my new place looks like. I'm not gonna show you this place. Cause I, you don't wanna see it. It just looks like an apartment. But when my, like my parents are redoing their basement for my boyfriend and I. And it's just gonna be like a little cute basement room. We're gonna have a separate bedroom and then we're gonna have a separate living room. Like it's not gonna be like a studio type setup. I'll have a physical bedroom. And I'll have like a whole living room, a small kitchen, a bathroom, like the whole, the whole situation, the whole shabam. Does anyone use those words anymore or am I just old? Oh, did I say how old I was yet? 26. I am old. Okay, I'm going to try to put these on. You know what I hate? My hand's cramping, that's what I hate. Okay, I am hoping my iPhone stays recording because I have so much storage. I just bought more iCloud storage though, it's only 99 cents for like the month to get 50 more gigabytes just so things can back up to it. Um, I don't know how iCloud works to be honest, but I just know like things will back up to it so then I will have more space to use on my phone because I think I can delete things. So sorry if this video is all over the place. I just want to get through this only because my phone has a ton of st like storage issues. Um, so sorry if this is like choppy. I'll try to Been with my boyfriend for three years as of November 8th so yeah we're moving in well I'm so stupid we've we're already moved in together here but like we're moving into my parents to save money um I have work tomorrow I wish I could just go to bed with a full face on it's like be comfortable but it's not comfortable I know this color doesn't match don't come for me It'll look fine at the end. But comment where you're from below in the comment section. Um, subscribe, like, uh, what else do you do on YouTube? <laughs> Share to your friends. I'm, you know, just doing this for fun. I took like a film class in high school and I actually enjoyed it. I think it was a film class, something like that, where I had to like make videos and stuff. It's kind of fun. I'm sure like people that do YouTube though full time, it's probably annoying to have to like edit. I can get that because like you put so much time into a video and now you have to go through the whole video and listen to yourself all over again. But I feel like it makes me appreciate people on YouTube more, like watching like doing my own YouTube video. I feel like everything is not even on my face. Um, but did anyone go to Halloween party this weekend? Are you handing out candy today? This is gonna be posted hopefully by tonight if I can do it. If not, I'll edit it tomorrow, maybe post it. I'm gonna try my best to get it up tonight if I can, but I'm so new to this whole video process. Um, so we'll see, we'll see, we'll see the heck is this oh my god that is so cool so you see this thing you just like watch me just like break my nail I'm like oh god so it like comes out and you can use it I'm gonna try this color it's like kind of cute my mom gave it to me it's it's Revlon color stay cream eyeshadow it's carrot why well, say is it caramel caramel? I don't know if they uh, meant to do that. Oh, it's actually cute. Oh no, it's so cute. That's so cute. I hate that. 
I'm actually like in a good mood today. Maybe it's because I slept till 10. Maybe it's because I slept the entire morning. Or maybe it's because I just slept in general. I'm having hamburger helper for dinner and I'm honestly super excited. I don't know if you guys ever had hamburger helper, but it, it slaps. Is that what they say nowadays? It slaps. Bet. 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 Sorry if anyone says that. I mean, I know. Uh, I know my friend Natalie says it, but <laughs> I don't say it, but when I hear people say it, I kind of laugh because I just, I don't talk like that. Like, I don't use that lingo. I don't know what to do. I mean, it's fine if you say bet. I just, I never understood it, I guess. I guess no one really says it around me. I think my boyfriend says it sometimes. But like, I think he says it. Says? I think he says. I think he says. I think he says. I can't talk. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, I'm hoping to, my goal, I guess my goal, next five year goal is, even though no one asked, um, it's to save for a house. So, by the time five years roll around, uh, I'm hoping that I am gonna be at least engaged, if not married, and then I'm hoping that I'll have a house by then, which I think I can do it in five years. I really only think that we'll need to stay at my parents for like two, maybe three years, but if you have the ability to move in with someone to save, I have heard it's a good thing to do. I mean, obviously it is. It's... So, hoping for the best. I'm gonna open up a savings account so I can like put X amount of money away each month. I'm not really good with saving, but I'm taking advantage of this. I need to because I need to learn how to save my money. Um, but yeah, what is everyone's like favorite thing to do? Like, do you have a hobby or do you like what do you enjoy doing if you had if you had the ability to do anything you want like anything like finances aside like if, if you had the ability to do anything what would you do and even if it's something like you're scared of doing but you want to do it i want to know so comment below I think I've asked you guys like 20 questions. I think I'm asking you guys more questions than telling you about myself. Um, I'll answer that question. I've always wanted to skydive to a degree, like to an extent. Really afraid of like dying during it. I know a lot of people do it, but you know, it's risky. So that's the only thing that scares me that like something would happen, you know? But like I've always just wanted to like have that feeling of like free falling if that makes any sense. But I feel like it would be really cool to be able to skydive. I used to be such like a daredevil when I was younger. I used to want to do I used to do everything. Oh, okay, well I consider being a daredevil going on roller coasters. <laughs> so maybe I'm not the right person what a daredevil is because that's like just a normal thing people do when i was younger my family used to bring me to uh bush gardens we used to go literally like all the time um and my brother hates roller coasters he hated them i don't even think i still don't think he i don't think he likes them still i don't know but he hated them and I wanted somebody to go on the roller coaster with. So obviously me being me, I need to invest in a camera. My iPhone keeps saying, you have full storage. It's probably gonna come up again and I'm gonna cry. This is what's gonna happen. But I think I haven't been able to say this because I think I went to record it and then it like didn't record because I think, I don't know. I bought more iCloud storage don't ask so like more stuff can be uploaded into there so I can have more space in my phone 
which I guess is like the trick to it, right? Oh, I didn't put concealer on, that's okay. We're gonna go without concealer because I guess, oh, I forgot to, that's all right. I say that's all right and then I sit here complaining. But there was a story I was saying in one of my recordings about how I always went on like roller coasters when I was younger, like my brothers hated them. And one time I told my brothers, we went to Bush Gardens every year and I told him, like I really wanted someone to go on the roller coaster with me. So I told him that this roller coaster did not go upside down. Cause I'm really mean and it did. And I told him that it didn't go upside down because I needed someone to go on the ride with because I was too afraid to go alone. So, <laughs> I traumatized him so I could have somebody go on the ride with. Anyways, he, um, I said, hey, let's go on this ride. It doesn't go upside down. It just goes like in turns and stuff. And he was like, okay. But he was like really nervous, right? Because like it's a roller coaster and obviously they're kind of scary. And like, I think I'm more afraid of them now than I was back then, which is kind of weird, I guess. I guess I just like, I'm outgrowing. I'm outgrowing them. Can you outgrow a roller coaster? I guess it's like, I don't know. But I don't go on that stuff anymore. I don't even go to amusement parks because I'm like kind of bored. Not really. Trust the process, please. I don't, but anyways, I made him go on with me. And after we got locked in, I said, listen, this roller coaster goes upside down, but it's not that scary because I can tell someone when it's not scary, right? Just kidding. Um, so yeah, he was kind of like upset that I did that, but like once the ride starts going, you can't like get off, right? So I'm like, it's okay, it'll be over before you know it. Just close your eyes when you go upside down. And I got him to go on his first roller coaster. <laughs> I'm so mean. Why did my parents let me do that? My parents knew he was afraid yet they still let him go on. Obviously, because if he's like, okay, I'll go on, but I apologize if this whole video is like chopped up. The iPhone has full storage. So it keeps shutting this video off. So I'm like, I don't know. I need to figure it out. I need to get a better camera or something. Not like a better camera, but like a camera. So like it can't keep saying that. But dude, it's literally 6.30 on a Sunday night. But yeah. I did that to him by accident. Not by accident, but I'm kind of mean, I guess, to my brother for doing that. That's okay, you know? You make someone do something that's out of their comfort zone. It it makes them. It, you know, it makes them, like, be more edgy. I got forced on my first ever roller coaster because I was in high school and we went as like a trip to this Six Flags. I don't know if you guys been there. We went on a trip and my friends wanted to go on the roller coaster. I was like, I don't do roller coasters. And they're like, so pretty much I got forced to go on a roller coaster. So you know, you just need a little push sometimes. Um, I'm really sorry that this is gonna be broken up a lot, but I'm, I'm running out of storage and I'm trying to, I'm gonna figure it out. I think I have a camera I can use. So I'll just do that for my next video. I have a camera, I just need to find it. I think that's all I was gonna do on my face anyways, so. But, oh shoot, no it wasn't. Just kidding, I'm over here like, she has no lips. Um, they're not as scary as they're like put out to be. Obviously there's risks with getting on a roller coaster, but I think it's worth it. I, I wouldn't go at my age now. Let me know if you go on roller coasters actually, or if you used to, right? Cause like I used to. All right, this is the finished look. I'm gonna close out the video. I am so sorry if it cut everywhere. Um, and if it like jumped where it was like, I barely had makeup on and then jumped and I had like half face on. My phone keeps super full in storage, so it keeps messing up. I'm gonna try to get it figured out. I have a camera, need to find it. I think I have it still, I need to figure out that situation. So I could probably use that camera to film. 
better than my iPhone and like taking up storage. But thank you so much for watching. If you can please like the video and then subscribe, that would mean the most to me. Um, and if you can comment anything that you would like to see, I would love ideas for different things that people would like to see me film. I was thinking maybe at one point, I don't really cook, but doing like a cooking video would be kind of cool. I don't know, let me know. Um, and again, thank you so much for watching and I hope you guys have a great day.